So when I was growing up, I always wanted or have this mindset that oh, when I get to 25, I'll be settled down. I'll have my own house. I'll have my car. I will have a business running. I'll have a good paying job. I'll be fully established. <laughs> this is super story. Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. On today's episode, I'm going to be sharing how my 20s has been so far. Guys, to be sincere, 20s is really challenging. It's draining. It's a stage where you don't even know how to go about life. It's like me being in the middle of an ocean and I don't know where to go we had to get to a dry land can you understand that feeling and i know some of us here can relate being in your 20s and you are jobless you are unemployed being in your 20s and you are still not being able to figure out anything you are still just there being in your 20s and you don't even have a relationship life <laughs> Oof. it's exhausting that's how i've been feeling since i clock this age some people are so lucky and things work out for them in their 20s things are going so smoothly in their twenties, but some of us are still trying to strive hard to overcome these challenges. Well, we should know this. This is what I've been using to encourage myself since the whole phase started. Twenties is not actually a stage where you have everything established and everything figured out. It's actually a stage of growing. It's actually a stage of learning. It's a foundation stage. So here are some little advice to some of us facing these difficulties and challenges in our 20s. I'm actually saying all oh, because I'm included. I advise myself every day. Firstly, do not be prejudged. Don't feel prejudged. Okay, I know these things usually happen. Most of us feel like, oh, look at my age mates. She's here, she's there. She's already in this place, she's already there, and I'm here. Don't be prejudged. Don't feel prejudged. I know this part can be so difficult, but try not to feel prejudged. Secondly is seek support. You actually know people that have your best interest in hearts. You can seek support from them. Ask them for support, ask them for advice, ask them, how will I go about this? How will I do about this? Your friends, family, people, in quotes, people that have your best interest in that. Because we all know it's not all friends that have your best interest in that. Number three is embrace change. Embrace the certainty and change that comes with this period and stage of your life. Be open to experience, new experience. Be open to opportunity for growth. That's another step to take. Number four is set goals. Set real long-term and short-term goals and work on them gradually. Number five is take care of yourself. Prioritize self-care, both physical and mentally. Do activities that actually gives you joy and relaxation. The other thing is learn from your failure. Don't see failure as something that's bad. No. Failure is actually part of experience. It makes you stronger and it makes you wiser. Another thing is to build a supportive network. Mingle yourself with positive people. 
people that are willing to uplift you and encourage you another thing is stay flexible be flexible and adaptable in your approach to life things may not really go as planned things may not really go how you want to be or well, being adaptable will help you navigate another thing is be financially responsible take steps to manage your finance wisely such as creating budgets and saving for the future so finally guys always remember you are not alone there are so many people out there facing similar difficulties and challenges in their 20s you are not alone eventually things will get better with time and with effort i hope you find this video helpful and encouraging please kindly do well to like and subscribe and i will see you in my next video bye guys Thank you.